Ladies and gentlemen, you could not be more welcome here this evening to the 8th Westport Festival of Chamber Music. My name's Chris O'Malley and I've been working with the festival for the past couple of years. Now, as some of you will no doubt have picked up, over the last 20 months or so, it's been a rather unusual time for us, specifically in the arts. We were, of course, to run a festival last year, but for obvious reasons, we weren't able to do so. I'd like to hand you over to my friend and a colleague, the Artistic Director of the Festival, Catherine Leonard. Thanks, Chris, and thank you all for coming here tonight. I'm feeling quite buzzed about what we're going to hear. And uh, firstly, I'd just like to thank our sponsors and the people who supported us, and Pierre, who allows us to still rehearse in his home, which is wonderful and board members and everyone who makes it possible for the festival to, to occur. We open and close the festival with Beethoven, my favorite composer. I make no apologies for that. And um, both the sonata that you're going to hear tonight and the string quartet, the Opus 131, are pretty devastating works actually, um, but in very different ways and composed far apart. Um, but despite this devastation, I know you're going to enjoy every note by these wonderful musicians tonight and over the next few days. I'd like now to welcome back wonderful pianist and friend Hugh Tinney and also friend Giovanni Guzzo to perform.
Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, this next piece uh, might be by a new and unfamiliar composer to you. Uh, it's the British composer Paul Patterson, and he wrote this wonderful piece, Tides of Mananan, in 1987. Uh, he was commissioned to write it for the, the 1988 Lionel Turtis International Viola Competition. So the piece exhibits a lot of the different techniques which are possible on the instrument, on the viola, and uh, it's inspired by Manx folklore, and the title Tides of Mananan is about this, this legend, Mananan, and I, I like to, to imagine these waves crashing against the Isle of Man, um, which I hope you hear in the music.
Thank you. 